What is going on YouTube? <clears throat> Welcome back to the channel. Hope uh, everyone is having a great day today. Just finished rain out, but it's nice out now, so that's good. Um, yeah, I picked up another CR250. It was kind of a project that this guy that I got off of started and it's been sitting for a couple years, he hasn't finished it, life got in the way, so I picked it up. It's pretty nice. Frames powder coated, so frames powder coated, swing arms powder coated. It's got the rims and everything done. It still needs a lot of work, just kind of cleaning stuff up and whatever all else. But we've got her set up in the couch garage here, on the garage and the couch here, just for now. And then I'm gonna throw it on the frame, throw it on the stand, and start putting her back together. But yeah, sorry, my shadows. Yeah, you can see whole frames powder coated black, and then. Triple trees are nice copper color there. Same as the rear shock, rear linkage. Got the swing arm there. And then these rims are absolutely beautiful. Try and get in all in here. But yeah, all black. That copper there is gorgeous. Um, both rims are that way. I just kind of got set up on the couch because I don't want it getting wrecked and then got all these boxes of other miscellaneous parts that I kind of got to go through and clean up. It's got a full pro circuit exhaust, silencer and expansion chamber. So yeah, got to put the foot pegs on so I can get it on the stand here. And then I can uh, start kind of piecing together. I got the motor too. Uh, it needs a cylinder, needs a little bit of love. It needs to be honed out. It's got a brand new piston, but uh, yeah, other than that, that's what the bike looks like right now. And um, yeah, I'm gonna put it on the frame, on the stand, and start working on it, so. Alrighty, so, <clears throat> got the bike on the stand here. I kinda thought that it was gonna tip over, but I guess with the swing arm and the rear shock, it's balanced pretty good here, but. Yeah, you can see the guy had it sitting for a long time. I don't know if you can see the dust on there or not. So, yeah, looks really good. Like, this copper really really shine so it looks pretty awesome I'm excited to finish this build for the guy well for me i bought it often but yeah that looks awesome um, yeah i'm gonna start putting it together i don't know what i'm gonna start with the motor is like done i just need the cylinder so i'll probably just pop the motor sorry yeah yeah <clears throat> yeah the cylinder um but yeah i'll probably just throw that in there and then kind of go from there. All right, yeah, so here's the motor. It's all been Cerakoted and everything, so the guy did a really good job. It looks awesome. I love that it's got that like stock look to it, but yet still has that like aftermarket like kind of touch to it, but I think that looks really good. I'm just waiting to get the cylinder back from him, but yeah, I need to clean up this a little bit here, but a little dirty but that's minor and yeah brand new bottom end all brand new bearing and everything in the motor so that's wicked yeah so just trying to uh wiggle the motor in there went pretty simple because there's no cylinder and that upper part of the motor is not in the way or anything so took the kickstarter out because it wasn't really lined up perfect and then uh yeah working on the swing arm here the linkage was kind of backwards or it was backwards so as you can see i'm looking at my other bike to make sure that it wasn't right but yeah it was backwards I had to flip that around there um and then it didn't end up fitting together uh, with the powder coating on the swing arm and the linkage it didn't really fit in there it was just that millimeter of like each side being powder coated was a little too tight so had to file that down and then uh yeah after i ended up filing it down the linkage bearings you'll see here i had to uh kind of tap them with a the hammer a little bit but yeah after that it lined up perfect no issues going in it was just a little tight but yeah that's all that needed and then the swing arm's good now and the motor's in there, so we'll move on to the next thing. Yeah, just making sure 
all the bolts and everything are greased up. I'm not tightening everything up right now. I'm just trying to mock everything up to see what I have and what I don't have. So just putting everything kind of together. Nothing's going to be too tight, but yeah, moving on to the brake here. Just pulling it apart, um, trying to clean it. I wanted to, yeah, just take it apart. I'm gonna get some new brake pads and everything for it. But for right now, just pulling it apart. Probably gonna get some new brake lines as well. They're a little, not in the greatest condition, but they're not too bad. Um, yeah, as you can see, the foot pedal there, it's all like kind of shitty red color up in the top right. But uh, yeah, just taking that apart. Took it to the grinder, grinded it up, well, to the bench grinder. Um, yeah, slowly kind of working away at that, just trying to get it back to that metal, get all that paint off. So, yeah, there it is, working away at it. Nothing too crazy, but it's coming along. Just wanted to kind of do a little piece there. Um, I think I throw the Kickstarter on there too. Just kind of taking the wire wheel to it polishing it up getting all that paint and dirt and dust off so yeah so that's that um i think we're gonna move on to the next part here quick rear engine mount there just you know, had some rust on it so i wanted to make it look like it was nice and clean it's you don't see it or anything but just for my own purposes when it's in there you're not gonna it's not rusty or not it's clean put some grease on it should stay yeah there i am just kind of working away on the kickstarter um, Yeah, just throwing the rear rim on there. Obviously, I don't have a tire, but I, like I said kind of earlier, I'm just trying to mock everything up, putting the forks in. They, uh, I'm going to take them out. I'm probably going to end up painting the housing black or something. I'm not 100% sure yet. But, yeah, threw that rear tire on. Um, it's got brand new bearings and everything in it for when I pick it up from that guy. Um, yeah. I just wanted to put it together so I can see what I got and then uh, threw the shorty exhaust on there. It's not in the perfect shape, but still kind of going to clean that up too. I got the brake lever on there as well after I cleaned that up. Yeah, now we're just throwing the front tire on, greasing up that uh, shaft there that goes in the wheel. And uh, yeah, just throwing that on. Yet again, no tire but i'm just trying to get stuff out of the way and organize it all so that's where i'm at and see what i got yeah just finishing up with the front tire there then uh puppy dog comes by and i'm gonna put the handlebars on here and then uh i think that's pretty much it for what we did but yeah like i kind of mentioned just mocking everything up i just kind of want to get it over the box and see what i got and then uh I'll end up taking the most of it all apart again and cleaning it and whatever all else, just trying to keep a mental tally for parts I got to order. Well, I think that's probably going to be it for the video today. Just, yeah, wanted to kind of throw the motor in, put the rims on, kind of bolt up the swing arm, put a couple other things in there. Just to kind of see what I'm working with, because obviously, as you kind of know, uh, came, in, came in boxes, I got some other stuff up there but uh and some stuff all over the workbench but it's getting late so kind of got an idea what i want to buy i always you know have tires yet but uh yeah just a couple other things i just wanted to put together and see what i got but i'll show you what she looks like right now these handlebars were not the ones the guy gave me they were off a different bike which is in there which you all can watch the channel you don't know what that one is yet and that's going to be a little bit of a surprise that i'm working on but yeah got some more lights coming in here tomorrow too so it should be a little lighter up a bit better but yeah the copper looks really good tank i don't know i just threw the silencer on there but yeah just kind of put some stuff back on i polished up the kick 
starter, rear brake, I got the foot peg mounts on. I kind of got that half on, but yeah, that's what we're working with right now. It's not too bad. It's coming along. I've got the cylinder, I just need to hone it, and then a couple other things, but. Yeah, well, I think that's gonna be it here for the video today, so if uh, y'all like it, leave a thumbs up. Comments are always welcome and wanted just for feedback and let me know how I'm doing and everything. If you haven't yet already subscribed, I'll link it in the web, I'll put it in the description, but link to the website for all the merch, hats, hoodies, shirts. Got some more hats coming down the line, some new stuff, so keep your eyes open for that. And uh, yeah, I hope all y'all have a great day and uh, catch y'all later.